They look too weird. I mean, aren't they supposed to look weird and stand out? Alright, I gotta go heal. Just run along the track in a mine. No way I'll break an ankle doing that. Oh, fuck. You just need to go outside the cave? That is true. What's Yamper? Uh, Yamper is my electric corgi that I've been using. I use him a lot because um, he has Nuzzle and it paralyzes every time. And so that's really great for catching Pokemon. You catch things easier if they're paralyzed. Oh, hey, Diglett! Oh, I want... Nope. Mm -hmm. I want that. Are Team Yell the real villains? Ah, probably not, but I don't want to be spoiled. Normal switch or switch light? Normal switch. That's why I'm playing, like, on a pro controller and stuff. Are they paralyzed? Be cute. No, I think it's by electricity. Yeah, Diglett's awesome. Diglett's also really good in Gen 1 challenges that allow for multiple Pokemon. Because um, in Gen 1, critical hit chance is based on your base speed. Diglett, once it becomes Dugtrio, has really crazy high base speed. And, uh... And it also, in Gen 1, Dig is as strong as Earthquake. And so it gets the stab um, damage, which is same type attack bonus. And it's a strong move, as strong as Earthquake. And you have a high crit chance. Doug Trio is a beast in Gen 1, as a result of just all those things coming together. It's like Alakazam, how Alakazam, there's a lot of them in Gen 1, and they're really, really dangerous. Because, they're again, their base speed is so crazy. All right. Who do I land on? Cheriamore? Maybe how you pronounce that. There we go. And back down. There we go. Send a box for now, but I might end up using that later. I do really like Diglett. I actually have a challenge coming out tomorrow where I have a Diglett. Uh, tomorrow at the time that this is being streamed, that is. It'll already be out by the time the YouTube version goes up. But uh, I have a Gen 1 pair of heavy-duty boots. Hmm. That's kind of cool. Held item, I guess. I have a Gen 1 uh, no new Pokemon challenge. Or sorry, no, no new moves challenge coming out tomorrow where every Pokemon I use in it, um, I can only use whatever moves they started with. It really changes up your strategy. It was a fun run to do. Who is this loser? Is that the no new moves one? Yeah. Any shinies in this room? Or I gotta call stop calling them shiny. So I'm so used to calling little sparkles shinies in games. But that means a different thing in Pokemon. Okay, this guy looks like a loser, but the song is okay so far. So is he our rival? Like our actual rival rival, not like... Not like our best friend, you know? Ah, this song rocks, though. Uh, that thing is just pure psychic. So I'll paralyze it and start biting. Thought he was a girl? Uh, I, I didn't catch the name. How does no new moves work for a Pokemon that only has like two moves to begin with? You just don't use just that Pokemon, obviously. You gotta build a whole team. You, you end up building a team based around who has good starting moves rather than uh, 
than who necessarily has the best stats. It leads to really interesting strategies. Has the rival ever been a girl? I don't know. Um... It depends on who you consider your rival in Gen 3, I guess. Because Wally's a guy, but uh, if you pick to be a guy in Gen, in, in Gen 3, then your counterpart is Mei, who's a girl. But I don't know if you consider her the rival, Wally the rival, or both of them rivals. Because Mei doesn't really have much to do with the story. Neither does Wally, in fairness. I think you fight Wally three times and only one fight is a real fight. Or was it two times? God, it might just be two. There's schedule for streaming and uploading to YouTube. I tweet out my schedule every single Monday, and I also put it on my Discord server every single Monday. You can find my Twitter and my Discord server in the description of everything that I do. Double kick. I do kind of like that move. This on Wulu. Weird thing to get it. Okay. I will replace Copyhead because I hate that move. Has the road to 250 going? It goes up and down wildly depending on when, um, when Pokemon, Pokemon, God, the word Pokemon is just so embedded in me now. When Twitch Prime subs, you know, they don't auto renew. So it depends on how much I'm streaming and it depends on when they line up. At this exact moment, where's the tab for that? Here it is. At my exact moment, let me refresh the page. I have 224. Okay, that's pretty good. So getting close, uh, 26 sub points away and higher tier subs count for more according to Twitch. Yeah, pretty close. So 250 is the all time record right now. That's what Twitch is telling me because that number is something Twitch selects for me. Oh, is that new? What is that? It looks like a Kirby enemy. It looks like it should give me ice type wizardry when I eat it. Uh, see a cherry more. I still don't know if I'm saying that right. Fluctuate between 100 and 120. Yeah, it depends on prime subs. It really is a Kirby enemy. I know, right? It really looks like one. What type is it? Psychic fairy. Oh, I, I'm new to fairy type. I don't know what the hell is good against fairy. I think it's poison. Um, but you said it was also psychic. So let's have my fox eat it. Snarl. Pure psychic right now, okay. That lame ass move warranted a special line in animation? Okay. Alright, I win. <laughs> Lame? New from the YouTube channel. Awesome. Yay. I beat Trainer Shit Heal. See, I didn't need to catch that stupid bird. Fuck that bird. I paralyzed it and let it go just so it can suffer. That is pretty cool looking. I kind of like that one. I came from YouTube. Most people do. I, I mostly get my uh, Twitch traffic through YouTube. Who here found me through Twitch out of interest? Very strong against fighting, dark, and dragon, and is weak against poison and steel, and immune to dragon. Interesting. I'm just happy that poison is strong against another thing, because it's my favorite type, and it was very marginally useful offensively. 
found me through Leonard French. Wow. Yeah, I found you before that. Um, I have bumped into you a few times over the years, mostly thanks to uh, Camera Girl, I believe was her username. But uh, yeah, I bumped into you a few times over the years. I don't remember when we first started talking, though. Talk to Jur. Who's Jur? Okay, you guys said to stop shaking when the tree's already shaking itself. So I'll, I'll take your word for it. Any shinies around here just kind of feels like the kind of place they'd put a shine. It's sparkly right there. Boom. Really gotta stop calling them shinies. That child's not a Pokemon. What's that in the middle of them, though? Oh. Chicks regardless. Oh. Things when you made the Star Mazer video? Yeah, I think this is the first time I ever reached out to you in that way. No, I don't want to get paralyzed. Ah, you fucker. Oh, I didn't get paralyzed. Okay. Are electric Pokemon immune to paralysis in new gens? Because they didn't used to be. Get away from me, child. Oh, hold on, what's, what's that chasing me there? I like the silhouette, like you could mistake the silhouette of Wooloo for anything else. Gotta go. Got some work to do. I have a plan, I'll DM you later. Sweet! I hope you have a good night. Oh hey, it's Electric, I like these. You can get Eevee here? I like Eevee. I'll catch an Eevee. Ooh, you think you found me through the Magikarp one? That was one of my early ones. That was a good run. Very, very long one. That, that, that fucking Magikarp one took me forever. And I hate that so many of the comments I get on it now are just like, you're ripping off J-Rose, even though J-Rose did his Magikarp Fire Red Leaf Green run way later than me by like three months. Which isn't me throwing shade on J-Rose, by the way. I actually quite like his videos. I shouted him out in my first Pokemon challenge. But, um... No, my my fire red, um, my fire red magic run was not a ripoff of his fire red magic run because mine came out three months before his. Also, he said in his he thinks he's the only guy to uh, ever do it without using save states in battle. Yeah, I, I didn't use save states in battle. That's cheating. I think he just doesn't know my run exists, which is fine. I don't care. <clears throat> I don't own my time. Or, other way around, he doesn't owe me his time? You know what I mean. He doesn't need to watch my shit. Who cares? Alright. Let's name it. Call me Joshi. I'm gonna just spell it normal. Because you spell it weird. Like that? Yeah. You're my favorite Twitch streamer. Thank you. I'm surprised you haven't found someone better. Came from the Sunkern Challenge. I'm happy someone watched it. Because the Sunkern Challenge isn't very watched, even though I think it's... Ah, get away from me. Uh, even though I think my Sunkern one is one of my best runs. It's probably the hardest run that I actually succeeded. Because the Sunkern run was insane. What was this one's name? Call me maybe No. Fight me, strange-looking thing. Pumpkaboo. Oh, I've heard about this one. Yeah, the Sunkern run was hell. It was probably the hardest one I've ever done that I actually succeeded. It was my second ever run. Jesus, that one was hard. This is a Gen 6 one. Yeah, I knew it was 6 or 7. Catching it? Yeah, I always catch it. Ghost and plant, I'm guessing you mean grass, and and physical attacker. That's interesting. Mm, pluck 
probably won't kill it. It will be super effective. Looks like an interesting Pokemon, I just don't know if I can fit on my team. Yeah, it's kind of how I feel about a lot of Pokemon. Ah, well, that kicked the shit out of it. Interesting, it has different visual sizes. It can be the larger it is, the more HP, smaller, the more speed. That's a really cool gimmick. Oh, my eyes are bucking out on me. Come on, heal me. Monotype playthrough. No. Monotype playthroughs are A, reasonably easy, and B, a really great way to ruin your casual playthrough. I'm just trying to have fun. What the fuck? <laughs> That's really ugly. Is it supposed to look like Totoro? I don't know. Are you grinding? No. I like a lowland meowth. Don't know if I like this one. What type is it? Rock? Because it said that Swift wasn't very effective. Steel. Okay. Huh. Please, guys, I need 100 more of you to tell me that it's steel after you've already seen the rest of the chat tell me. <laughs> do you plan to do the grass gym in this stream? I have no idea. I don't even know the order of the gyms. I, I'm just playing the game casually, guys. I'm just having fun. You don't need to spoil things for me. All right, what am I naming it? Uh, fall in love with the Seven Days to Die series. Keep up the great work. Thanks, I appreciate that. I really like that series. I want to record more of it. And also, you're the person I landed on. Emil? I think that's how you say that. How long should the stream be? I have no idea. I'm, I'm Maybe I'll end it soon? I, I might, honestly, because I really do need to get this run done. Cleanse tag. Ooh, that's a nice one to find early. I might even just end it reasonably soon, just because I get away from me. I need another one of these. Just because, like, I, I hate to do a short stream, but uh, I really do need to get this Pokemon challenge done. I just wanted to uh, take a short break from it. Ooh, pre-stream ended up going on longer than I expected, though. Maybe I'll just stream again tomorrow? I don't know. Oh, hey, a fishing, a fishing spot. Let's catch something. What a king Yeah, he's in chat pretty often. I already have a magic card. Brandon traded me one. Ever gonna do Nuzlocke? No, I don't really find Nuzlocke's fun. Don't wear yourself out. I appreciate the sentiment. I actually made a tweet, like I think it was yesterday or the day before. It was on International Men's Day. I, ma I made a tweet about how I, I get really annoyed when people keep telling me to take a break. Your heart's in the right place, though. I, I'm not annoyed with you specifically if you do that. It's it's no big deal at all. It's it's uh it's just ah uh, it's so frustrating when people constantly tell me to like take a break or whatever and like they just kind of assume I don't take care of myself. I guess I don't know. It's just frustrating when everyone's like take a break and it's like dude I I have to work like this money is how I'm gonna like have a kid and put them through college one day like I can't just not do my job. Plus, you know what stresses me out a lot more than hard work is uh, not getting work done. I like feeling productive. That's just how I am. I'm a hard worker. Have you ever uh, done or thought about a trainer only run as in the only source of XP? I get requested that a lot. Um, I've considered it. I could do something with it. I don't know. It's, it's low priority just because it's a high research run. It's one that I really need to research into. I can't just not do my job. I don't know. Seems to work for Canada Post. Solid logic on Retra. You know, we had a Canada Post delivery the other day, but it's because Fatima was walking down the street and saw a lost Canada Post person. 
and was like, oh, he, like, what place are you looking for? And she showed the address and they're like, oh, that's our address. And so she walked us to the front, she walked her to the front door. So it's the first time we've had a delivery from Canada Post come to our door in five years, but they were lost. And it was Fatima happened to bump into the lady and help her find our place. It's not hard to find our place, everybody. Every other courier can find our place. Oh, it's amazing. Unfucking believable. Oh, wait, that thing's part ground type, isn't it? Or is it part electric? Either way, I can't paralyze it. Starter only challenge? It'd be too easy. Starters are powerful. I mean, I've kind of done a starter only challenge now because I've been working on a uh, Pokemon Yellow Pikachu only run. That'll probably be not tomorrow, but the week after Saturday. And that's the starter for that game. So I guess I've done a starter only challenge. You guys will see how that goes when that goes up. I'm, I've just started editing that one. Ooh. Did they give the order the girl specific orders not to try or something? I don't know. Probably it's Canada Post. Haven't you already done Pikachu only? Yeah, in Platinum. It's totally, totally different in Gen 1. Different moves, different stats, different trainers to fight. Different base game mechanics, like how crits are based on base speed. Get away from me. Oh, pin missile. That's... Eh. Probably not going to use it. Yeah, I gotta go heal again. Quick soft lock Pikachu only Pokemon yellow uh, no new moves run. Oh yeah, because you wouldn't um, can't beat ground types. Well, actually, no, you could um, struggle. And there's no trainer in the game that has both ghost and ground type. So no, I don't think that's a soft lock. Unless he can tell me where I get locked. Other way? No, I just I just healed. I'm good. Oh, was there an Eevee in there? I wasn't looking. I was just trying to get heals. Oh, is there also a Poke Center right fucking here? Why do they have that heal lady and a Poke Center right here? Oh god, don't tell me I gotta fight my rifle right now. Oh no, it's this person. That's a Gaim leader if I've ever seen one. The struggle kind of a new, new move? No. You start with it. Oh, well, he's gone. Oh, no. What's-his-face is right there. I don't want to talk to him. He's probably going to talk to me if I get close, though. I like spinning in this game. It's my favorite part of the game. All right. One shot his team. Eh, next time, I gotta get back to work on my challenge. Have you done a ditto-only challenge? Nope, Caspery did, though. Go watch him. Oh, God, I'm feeling rough today. But I gotta get back to work on that. So, uh, I'm gonna get back to work on that. I got too much shit to do. All oh, my limbs are broken. I have an elbow pad and a wrist brace on. Yay. Uh, thank everybody so much for watching the stream. I might stream tomorrow. I'll see how much time I have. I know this was a short one, but uh, I'll, I'll try and stream tomorrow. I'll try and keep you guys up to date on Twitter or something. Maybe I'll stream after the Pokemon challenge. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Thank you everybody so much for watching and until next time, have a nice day.